So, Brother Ati, you got a you got a newspaper there. It's called the African Independent. That's right. And on the cover? On the cover, we've got our great uh, Michelle. Samora Michelle. Samora Michelle. One of the greatest leaders I used to respect. Mm. Out, of, out of Mozambique. Yeah. Was now, when you when you say one of the greatest leaders you used to respect, how many great leaders did you know? Because you sound like you do a lot. What 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 what? Uh, give me give me your give me your, some of your just list. A few of them. One of Uganda. Mas, what what is his name now? Kruma. Doctor Kruma. I forget the first name. And the next one was Kenyatta. But of isn't it, isn't Kruma out of Kruma uh, of, of uh, Ghana? Of Ghana, of Ghana. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the was of Ghana. Mm, 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 mm. And then uh, Kenya, Kenyatta. Joma Kenyatta. Joma Kenyatta was another one. Is that a what, Kenya? Kenya, yeah. Near Kenya. Yeah. His son is now operating as a president of Kenya, isn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Who's the next one? Uh, I just forget the name of this guy on the western side of South Africa. Oh, we the the word that the the the, the CIA killed had in the trunk and and um, John Stockwell had in the trunk of his car. Oh man, what's the brother's name? I'm, I know who killed him now. No, do not remember who it is. <laughs> um, I know, I know who you're talking about. I know exactly who you're talking about. I'll get to it. It'll come back to me. But you know, because actually Dave Chappelle's mother used to be an aide uh, 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 in his entourage. Um, God, from from the DRC, uh, and uh, and Seiko, uh, um, uh, that guy um, that had the rumble in the jungle, president guy, uh, uh, Seiko, whatever his name is, the the, the dictator, Mobutu, and uh, Frank Mobutu is the one that uh, Mobutu that did him in. Mm. Well, what I can say, the CIA did him in, and then Mobutu took his place. He was one of the, one of his again one of his aides or whatever it is. Like that, but keep going. I, I, Lumo, what was Lumumba? Lumumba. 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 Nah, Lumumba. Yeah. Yes, that's what we're talking Lumumba. about. Yeah. yeah. No, he didn't have a long, long, long to go. Like that. He was killed, isn't it? Yeah, I'm saying the CIA yeah, killed him. The CIA, uh, they killed him. You know. Mm. And you know what? Now, two of my favorites. Actually, I got to interview. Oh, I said interview, but I recorded. Uh, oh, you know these guys so, as well. Not those guys. Not those guys. Just a little bit. What before. I mean, uh, you've got an idea about. Oh yeah, sure, 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 sure. Not I, that I, you know. I had them, a too. very, I had a, I had a revolutionary education. education. That. <laughs> but when he was in yeah. New York, Thomas Sankara, oh, from Burkina Faso, came to New York, and there's somewhere they exist. I have a tape. Now I have always in my archive of uh, of Thomas Sankara. He was in New York and recorded him, like that. Is that so and that, now that's the cat. Now you 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 know you 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 got your Chris Honey, but I'm telling you, man, and you got your you got your Robert Sabukwe, you know Mangalisa Robert Sabukwe, but Thomas Sankara, that cat, young cat, that man. Was he in uh, Up there in Burkina Faso. Burkina Faso. They used to call it Upper Volta or whatever it is. Mm -hmm. Up there, the same same thing with um, the other brother, um, uh, with Guinea. Um, that Ferrer went and whatever. Um, I remember all these names sooner or later. Um, like that. That's another one of one of my uh, one of my peoples. But you know, you know, person down you here. We didn't have a good chance of learning about these guys too much because the whites were pressing us to know much about independence and all that. You see. Well, that's so, right. I got I got the name. I'm sorry, I don't want to interrupt you. But Amaka Cabral. That's another cat. Another cat. I'm a cock around. Man. Then there's this, there's this other cat. 
out in Tanzania, not not Nairi, but another cat, his lieutenant, one of his lieutenants, and another cat. But you know who? I'm, I don't again. I don't mean to interrupt you, brother. brother Isaac, no, but no, I, no, I got to no. get these names out while it's still in my mm -hmm. head. Mm -hmm. um, but one cat that I really like. I don't know everything about him, and I, and I think that he gets swept under the thing a lot. I think he don't get the credit that he. I guess when he, when he, if he finally ever leaves us, yes. then all of a sudden all the stuff's gonna come out. But Kenneth Kunda, I love oh, Kenneth yeah. Kunda. Yeah, yeah I, I love, love Kenneth Kunda. I love Kenneth Kunda. I met him mm -hmm. one time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He he took his time. It was weird. He, I was, it was at, I was at UCT, I was teaching UCT, and I was doing the class, and I, when I finished the class, it was a conference, and I snuck into the conference, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> I think they were just coming off a break or something like that, so I walked into the room, you know, he's, he's sitting there, I didn't know who he was, and when I say, I mean, I knew his name, but yeah, I didn't know, know, I didn't know, didn't know that, that, he, that was this. this is the guy. And he calls me, he calls me over, you know, I'm going like, yeah, young brother, come here. Yeah, uh, so I came over there. And we, he says, blah, blah, blah. We start talking. You know, he's just a nice, he's just chatting. Mm -hmm. You know, he's just a mm -hmm. nice cat. You know, he's just chatting. I just liked him. You know, I immediately just liked him. I, I immediately liked him. I know what they mean by charisma of, of things because I just immediately liked this guy. So then the, the session begins. Was he from Zambia? Was he yeah, Zambia. Yeah, yeah, Zambia. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, the, the former Northern Rhodesia, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. But then, well, let me just finish this thing real, 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 real quick. But then the, the session starts, and then they call him up, Kenneth Kuna. I said, whoa, Kenneth Kuna. But here's what I love about Kenneth Kuna. I love this. What he, when he got up there, the first thing he did was he sang. He sang a song. It wasn't even a struggle song. I don't think it was. It was just he sang a song. That's how he started his talk. And I'm going like, I'm going to do that too one of these days. <laughs> and I certainly never did it. I've done it a couple of times. I can't even sing. I just sing. I just <laughs> go care. I'm sorry. So, so you're saying the, the, the whites and, and how they, they still yeah, educate them? You want us to know about these guys. And to, once you spoke about them, you're highly in trouble. You go, how do you know this? And why do you like him? Or whatever. Well, how and did they? Yesterday I was watching one of these things, how they treated people. They showed how they. They were fucking us around, you know. kicking that guy. Uh, I think it was pa pa pa. Is it pa? And uh, he was still young then. Mm. They were showing it yesterday on TV. And yesterday or Sunday, sometimes. You know. So some of these guys we couldn't, you know, it's just mm. because of reading sometimes. I mean, your books you shouldn't just read any book. You I didn't travel. Why did you get it? Mm. Mm. Well, when, when they take, took all those historic books uh, you don't, so that you can't read them, you know, but... I don't know, this day and age, it doesn't seem like people want to replace those books or get new ones or anything like that. It seemed like the books went and never came back. Because mm -hmm. a lot of people still... Some of these people want them back. They want to rewrite these books. I don't know what's uh, no, holding them back, what to do there. And they are scared of getting the information. The information because they know uh, if we can read those books, we can revolt. Well, right in that African Independent, they have this whole thing on the internet. Mm -hmm. And how come uh, these African leaders are strangling the internet because they're afraid of like what they call an Arab Spring, the people will will share stuff and and, 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 and and interrupt, you know, whatever it is. But you but Master Cody, you was you was talking about something. Let me turn this thing on you for a second. I'll give Brother Ati some juice. Brother Ati, oh, this is this is good juice. Good. That that juice, you know, <laughs> give, give you give Gives you, you uh, yeah, okay, yeah. energy. <laughs> now you say something about Let's go. You say something about the internet and the internet. Uh, yeah, the internet is very good for us these days because we are. It's a good way of sharing the information that we are having, even the struggles that we are having, even the solutions that we want to get in future. Is the best thing to use internet, whereby even now it's on Fizma's phone. We know what is happening through the internet, and we know which universities are in danger and which people that are causing all this chaos is the politicians and the and the police the students have nothing to do with this but they are certain individual to the students who just provoke because they don't want to be in school some of them mm -hmm. some of them they don't know what is happening they just go in and do the chaos because 
they see the others fighting, but the police are the major people who are trying to do the the problem on the Fismas war. They're provoking. Yeah, they are provoking because the students, when the students are doing the, the peaceful marches, they are starting to shoot. Mm. They are starting to do all that chaos. So we are getting the information. We and we are in. We are sharing the information over the internet. When you say we, well, because now you're you're not in university, so, so <laughs> what do you care if he's fall or not? Because I'm part of the universe. The universe get the the information. The university get the information from the universe. So I'm the part of the universe. I'm sharing the information of the universe to the university. Mm. But you were saying something also because, like, and, and I don't do it, but in the states, mm. it's a big, like Instagram and Twitter and a bunch yeah. of things, a big thing. But you're saying that's not so big here. That, that's not so big here. The, the 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 major thing that we are getting informed by it's Facebook. You won't get so much information about Twitter and other stuff. Facebook is the most, 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 most something that we are using here. WhatsApp is nothing. The, the Twitter is nothing, and uh, this thing, well, the, the Instagram. Mm. We ain't using so much of Instagram. We are sharing most of our information mm. to through Facebook. Facebook is so much powerful to, to our generation here in South Africa. Mm. All the information that is necessary, we are getting it on Facebook. Mm. Well, Brother Ati, back to you. Now, we hear Nastoli, he's talking about, you know, the internet and Facebook. How did you get your? How did how did you all get information? I know that at one particular point there was a thing called the London recruits who would set these uh these uh information bombs off and let scatter like leaflets to say that ANC was still alive or somebody was still alive and they were doing stuff. But how did you get your information in PE or wherever you were at? How did you know what was really going on? If did you ever know what was really going on? No, I we used to have meetings at a place called Emlutin. This place was called MLT. That's where the ANC members used to hold meetings. Mm -hmm. For that matter, I remember of a lady called Rufus. He used to come to these meetings. And Mr. Mandela also was once, I think twice, to those meetings. But we are under Mr. Raymond Mshaba. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah um, he um, was the um, main um, guy. Yeah, um, he was the main guy. He was staying at a place, uh, place known as a, po a post with uh, Mr. Tsangan, who was uh, he's staying in one of these locations, uh, these villages around here. So they used to be the main guys in PE mm -hmm. and inviting Mr. Mandela's and this lady called Ruth, Ruth, Ruth I think Ruth Rufus, and we uh, get some information from them. Though we had our own leaders, like mine was Mr. Zula. We used to stay in the same street, Lloyd Zula. That's mm -hmm. why he, he, he used to come around and tell us what's going to be done and all that. Mm -hmm. And tell this guy, we said, we're having a meeting. Out, out, out. Disturbing us, man. Goodbye. Goodbye, man. <laughs> <laughs> it was a Mr. Lula. So he used to tell us what's going to take place. And, mm -hmm. and I, where is it? He put me. He used to come and tell us what's going to take place and all that. Mm. That was his mystery holder and he got the, got the information from the big guys. Well, we didn't know much about the big guys. They always bring the information what should be done and like going to, as I said before, we must go to the bridge where there's this European line side <laughs> and the black side. But we said, no man, these Europeans are not filling any page. We are filling the page now. <laughs> Which I'm not walking on the Euro Europeans, just walking on the side, there's no, uh, nothing is going to happen there. Mm -hmm. And then uh, they came around now with some other ideas. 
Who came around with other ideas? This uh, Mr. Lloyd Lola, the, the, our leader, mm -hmm. who was always bringing, you know, the, mm -hmm. what's to be done and all that. You know. Sometimes I think this, it was their own ideas. Yes. Uh, but you can see, no, these are not uh, good ideas mm -hmm. because they're killing you mm -hmm. more than doing any effect on the mm -hmm. other side. Well, that's a, that's an interesting question. You know, that well, as, as they say, that begs the question. Uh -huh. Do, weren't you worried about informants or, as you say, bad ideas? What, what how about informants and stuff like and things like that? Infiltrators and what they call what they call it counter revolutionaries or whatever you want to call yeah, these yeah, folks. Because most of these guys were not uh, learned guys. You know, uh -huh. they didn't know much about. Uh, some of them they just went to school up to a standard four. Which was standard for I don't grade what now, mm, but, uh, because it's called grades. What age? What's the age? It was, it was quite. Uh, it was about thirty. Thirteen. Thirteen. Thirty. Thirty. It was about thirty-six. It was. I was twenty-two then. Oh no! I meant what age was standard four? Or uh, what? What? In if you pass standard four, what age I range mean, were you? What? As a child, I said, I don't know now uh, how to call it because they are called in grades now. Uh, mm -hmm. Grade so and all that. All I want to find out now from the grade for we'll stand for maybe not 12, coming at 15. 12 years old? Uh, 13, 14, 15? Yeah, about 14. Yeah, because at that age you would get a guy that would 19 years still doing standard 4. Yeah. You see? Excuse me. So what was this information, well, the, I guess you're talking about tactics and strategies, you know, and how, was, uh, how would you know if a tactic or a strategy or, or information uh, would work or not? You'd have to do it and then fail or, or succeed? How, how did that work? That's why I say some of these guys were so not so clever to give us more because some of these things they failed mostly and then some of the guys were caught uh, they were caught before they were from the, and we had bimpies uh, we spies we yeah. That's spies they yeah. yeah, we called them bimpies mm. those are spies for the cops and all and mm. so before you could go and do anything everything is fucked and messed up mm. Mm. when you got killed we got caught before we could do anything if you caught them ahead of time, it recorded, if you caught them, what would what would happen to them? Uh oh, I have to play with them. If you could have seen this one, I'm talking about. Mm. What do I know? New stuff is torture. Torture. They tortured you. They mm. showed the film. I was crying yesterday. Well, I think yesterday or. Sunday, to show how they, these good boys used to torture people. Mm. And doctors used to say the doctors with them, you see, they, I mean, they, maybe they take a big stone, crush you or your, your toes, and then they say, oh, the doctor is going to fix you up. I'm going to fix you, don't worry, don't worry. The doctor is coming, he's going to pull all those nails out. Sure. Uh, and pull your nanga. <laughs> nanga is your pill. Uh, you know pill? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> used to pull those pills and uh, squeeze your to... intestines so that you can tell who you're working for. Uh, and why are you doing this? Now, you know, in, 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 in the States, I don't know. I was just watching it. My father was a policeman, and they, these guys didn't believe that we could be in the same category with the other people. Oh. He was also a nice policeman because he saved a lot of people out of a lot of things. Oh, cool. oh. It was quite difficult. Mm -hmm. The others were tortured to death. 
Because the corner in the one of I think it's Mzolis. He was my friend, the younger brother. Mm -hmm. Because my colleagues, they changed to PAC mm -hmm. when the PAC came up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Get out. You know, we, we, we got these wasps flying around here. And you know, they, you know the, 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 if the authorities were doing it these days, they've got what they call nano things that are little, little imitated insect, and it'll be a, it'll be a, it'll be a spy, it'll be a pippy. You know, they, they got a camera, they have little cameras, and it'll send the information back of what we're talking about. With this, uh, yeah, these little, this little, 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 little nano <laughs> things. <laughs> So, you know, that's interesting because, you know, struggle these days is different. And maybe this one is also in PMP because yeah. you know what we are doing around. Could be. Mm -hmm. But, you know, that, that's why this whole Facebook thing is no matter what they come up with, they, whoever they are, mm -hmm. there's going to be something, something, there's always something else, there's always something mm -hmm. else, there's always something mm -hmm. else. You know, your job is just to get ahead of, ahead of the something else, I suppose. Exactly. You know, did you ever get ahead? That's what, I guess that's a good question. Did you ever get ahead of the authorities. I mean, what did you, were you usually ahead of the authorities or were the authorities ahead of you? Or were you back, you know? What? I wouldn't know, I don't know to tell you lies. I wouldn't know whether we were ahead or not. But I think we were coming up. Hmm. I think we were coming up. But the pimpies were more dangerous than spying and who drew us a little bit more hmm. backwards. Mm. Giving the advantage to the authorities. Mm. Mm. Okay. And some guys couldn't stand it, and they start saying it out. Mm. Before you could even go to the other, things are messed up. Mm. Okay. Thanks a lot. Okay.